Hello, this is a video for Conestoga Cap Level 2 on Monday, April 1st, 2019. We just reviewed some things tonight because we have some people that are new to me and so I just wanted to kind of see what everybody was comfortable with. So if you weren't in class and you've had me before, you no worries. Um, so I'll just go through what we talked about tonight and next week we'll make sure that we cover some basic stuff and review a lot but we'll also work on some more complex combination for those of you who are ready to move on. So everyone will get what they need. First thing we did is we talked about flap heel heel combination, which goes like this, starting with the right foot. And what I'm going to do now is do that like a choo-choo train. So we're going to go slow and then get faster, faster, faster. Remember, as you get faster, to shrink your steps down so you're not wasting time making big movements. Five, six, ready, go. By the way, don't worry about arms too much with these videos. These videos, I'm really focusing on the feet so you can practice the feet, but we'll talk more about arms and do more arms within class, okay? So don't worry if you can't see my head and my arms right now. All right, so we did that and then we practiced our walking class and our running class. Practicing at home, just make sure that you're kind of jogging with it and not keeping your feet up front like you can, can. But try to get as fast as you can and see how many flaps you can get in a small space. So, make it really tiny, or I can really travel with it. So, be able to do both and be able to flap. So start out slowly and then try to push yourself to get faster, but keeping those nice crisp sounds. We also talked about pull out heel walking. And everyone was doing that fine. So again, try to see how fast. How fast you can get going and still keep those nice crisp sounds. That's always good to work on. Finally, we did some, or not finally, thirdly, we worked on Winter Wonderland just as a review. Here we are in April dancing to Winter Wonderland. <laughs> and it goes like this. Five, six, ready, go. to your partner. One, two, three, four, five, six. But we didn't really do that part yet. Okay, so that's Winter Wonderland. And then we talked about soft shoe. Let's start on the left this time. With soft shoe, remember the basic pattern is Break it down. The 
the more you uh, go fast, the faster you go, the more faster you can go, <laughs> uh, the more you can shrink it down. And instead of turning your body, you can start to just really cross your legs. So it's like, so my body's staying facing front and my legs are crossing as opposed to me turning my body like that. Also, you can add flaps to it. So when you're flapping, it's that like a choo-choo train. Five, six, ready, go. really fast. Um, so when you're flapping, as you get faster and more comfortable, it's, you're almost, well, you're actually flapping sideways. So instead of front, front, back, like that, it's a sideways thing. So it's so I'm kind of Going like this sideways and diagonal and so I'm flapping more in more different directions than just front and back so you'll kind of naturally get used to that okay and then we just reviewed buffaloes and uh, you can travel with buffaloes too if you're going really fast you want to be up on the ball to your feet we talked about Irish. You can practice getting faster at Irish and then be on the balls of your feet and eventually it can be like... But if you're not there yet, no worries. We'll get, we'll get there eventually. And let's see. And we talked about Broadway's Shirley Temples, but we didn't really delve into it. So we'll work on those. So if you want to try those at home, it looks like this. Heel, heel, stay heel, 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 stay heel, stay heel. So there's like two parts. But we didn't work on that much tonight, so if you don't have time to get it this week, no worries. We'll, we'll work on it more in class. Some people like to flap like the same way. Some people like to do it opposite. So you can either do full lap, same, opposite, or full lap, opposite, same. However you want to do your heels. I don't care. Um, it depends on where you learned them. So just pay attention to your choreography. If they want right, left, or left, right on your heels, just follow that. And we talked about scuffles, which should be called diggles because <laughs> it's digs. So it's good to do those and really just try to warm up that ankle and really smack the floor. It's a good exercise to build up the fine motor skills in your ankles. So that covers everything we worked on tonight and I'll see you next week. Happy tapping.